This is Condor. Apparently a game by Connor Sherlock. <laughs> As we are led to believe from this very simplistic title screen. I think I heard about this on Rock Paper Shotgun or Polygon or one of the video game blogs. Made for what I'm assuming something called the Cyberpunk Jam. I guess Game Jam to make a cyberpunk themed vid game. It's kind of a interesting uh, platformy jumpy puzzle, not really even puzzle thing, just a... Uh, let's find out. Ooh, that was... Bzz. Loading, loading. Yep, definitely made in, in Unity. Um, let's see, we're, we're, we're recording. That's pretty good. 30 frames per second for the recording. Not too bad. All right, so this this hopefully does does okay for uh, for for the YouTubes as well as for the stream. Yeah, so we're in a, a corridor here. We've got. Oh, sorry. I should have I should have walked forward, so you can actually. Here we go. W S A W S A D. That is the first time I've heard it written like that. W S A D to move. Mouse to look. The sensitivity is is too damn high. That's for sure. Uh, Spacebar to jetpack upwards. Get to the top of the spire is your objective. The yellow beacons are checkpoints. Don't look down while jetpacking. Press G to toggle the draw distance from near far. What are you, Grover? So yeah, <laughs> you could definitely tell it was for a cyberpunk game jam. Far, near, far. Let's try far to see. Yeah, still getting good frames, I guess. Uh, <laughs> you know, I really need a new computer if if a game with this high resolution of textures and complicated polygons requires me to <laughs> to check my frames. But yeah, we we basically have to get places. I I recorded an entire not an entire well like thirty minutes of this as a video, uh, trying to do like a one-off video, but I so I I kind of have a little bit of spoilers here at the beginning for myself, but. Uh, But I felt like it needed, like, perhaps I should try to complete it in a live stream and then just upload that video. So, alright. Easy, easy. So, yeah, really, don't fall off the edge to your doom is basically the name of the game here. Like I almost just did. Your jetpack gets you pretty far, but it does run out eventually. And you really have to be careful where you're jumping. Um, those little arrows... Ooh, that, that I forgot about. Yeah, those little arrows are like telling you where, from whence you should be going. So I'm going to try to make it over this ledge over here. Oh god. Oh, I just barely made it. Alright. I wasn't scared. I wasn't scared at all. Um. Oh, oh. Mm, maybe I should go. Yeah, there, there, it seemed, it's fairly open worldy. In that there isn't just one particular path to go. It's, it's very bright. There, I don't believe there's fall damage. I could just fall down there. There, there's whoa. All right. Ooh, I don't know if my jetpack will get me up there. Let's find out. Huh. Oh, e with ease, with ease. I bought the best jetpack on the market. All right, so okay, there's the arrow. Kind of an interesting, very uh, I don't know, fifth element esque or Blade Runner. Well, a cyberpunk. I, you know, that, that's the theme. So get used to it. Obviously, right up my alley of as to these weird games that I play, like like Cairo, like Proteus, like uh, Not. You know, uh, game jam games I think are pretty fun. Ooh, can I make it there? Uh, if I don't, I'll just land on that ledge. So I guess that's a <laughs> that's a sound attempt. Oh god! All right, see, I've run out. I've run out. I've run out. Oh god! Okay, good thing I planned that accordingly. 
This is called... Uh, what is it called? Condor. <laughs> Condor. There is another video game apparently called Condor, where you are indeed a condor. But this is not that one, obviously. I am not a condor. Uh, we have to follow this Starship Enterprise arrow to the right. Yeah. There, There's a save point with the very typical Photoshop-style lens flare. Filter... Render lens flare, lens flare. Go, 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 no, oh, ah, oh, the pipe, the pipe. <laughs> oh, oh, Danny boy, the pipes. Oh, the pipes are not, uh, are not very stable. You tend to slide off them. There we go, save. I wish I was Naztec. This is the mountain voice coming back again. Or a runner in Peru. I would build such beautiful buildings to house a chosen few, like an Inca from Peru. <laughs> Poetry, everybody. Poetry. Um, can I fail here? Yes, I most certainly can. Alright, yeah, so these are checkpoints, so if I do fall to my doom, I will come back here. <laughs> Very nice. Kind of, what, oh, what was that one? Uh, I haven't played it, but the, uh, the parkour game. Parkour to you. Kind of almost has elements of that, just at least... The, the jumpy, runny thing. Uh, I don't think a wall, like wall jumping and, and doing crazy parkour things is, is an element here, but what was the name of that? I'm glancing at the chat while trying to avoid falling to my doom. Mirror's Edge, Mirror's Edge, thank you very much. Didn't, did they release that on the PC? I swear I saw it on Steam. And I think they're working on a sequel, aren't they? Ha! Whoa! Alright, so we got a... There's another save point. It's really hard to know what you're supposed to do and where you're supposed to go. So you just kind of go from save point to save point. Hup! Hip! Uh, okay, let's see if we can make this... Alright, that was... Go, oh God, don't... Ugh. Come on, jetpack, don't let me down. Alright, so let's go over... Ooh. Little space highways going on down there. Lens flare. <laughs> oh, man, that's like the first thing when you get Photoshop is you put lens flare on everything. Thank you very much, Candle Pup, for for watching the stream and going back to lurking. Well, I'm not saying you should have been lurking, but I'm, you know, for enjoying the stream. Oh, whoa, there was a gap there. I should be careful there. Waste. Waste. I'm not sure. It says the goal is to get to the top of a spire. I haven't quite seen any spires. This is Condor. Uh, if I was smart and a professional streamer, I would have, like, given uh, the bot some sort of link to spit out every once in a while <laughs> to let you know what it is and where to get it, but I'll do that at the end of the stream. Uh, well, now people are saying they can't find it, so... Alright. Condor! Let me look up... Condor, it is a pay-what-you-will... Uh, game. That is to say, you should support the developer. Uh, Condor. All right, that's not working. Condor game. Yeah, you get this actual Condor game. But Condor by Connor Sherlock. Here, let me let me read the uh, the synopsis here. Condor, you are tasked with the hacking into hacking data nodes throughout. Neoquasquo. Just get close enough and our team will do the rest remotely. Proceed to the top of the spire to complete your assignment. This is important. 
Other teams are running a diversionary acts of cyber terrorism, so you could not encounter so you should not encounter any resistance. You are a valued employee. Praying Mantis. We are working for the Praying Mantis. So here here is the link. Uh, that will show up in the chat, and then we'll be lost for the rest of the remainder of the stream, and I will continue to be asked for the for for the link. Condor link. All right, there there's the link where you can get it for yourself. But you're watching me play it, so why would you want to do that? No, you can you can do that. Support the developer. Support the development of Vidge Games. Vidge Games. Press Escape to resume. All right, and we need to, uh, probably should have gotten the save point before that happened. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, the, the mouse, super sensitive. I, I could reduce its sensitivity, but, uh, said the condor to the praying mantis, we're gonna lose this place just like we lost Atlantis. Brother, we gotta go. Sooner than you know, the gypsy told my fortune. She said that nothing showed. <laughs> Dramatic readings of text. I don't know if you guys can even see that text. It's pretty small for the stream. Yes, the music has definitely taken a very Blade Runner turn. <laughs> with the synthesizer uh, instrument there. Alright, so... to the waste department. Down a series of tubes. Let's see if we can get to the top tube. I think the top tube is the tube to, to get to. Alright. And... Leop. Oh yes! Easy, easy does it, easy does it, and like a glove! Like a glove. Whoa, whoa, whoa! God, the mouse is so sensitive. I think that does add to the experience and the difficulty, but good lord, you sneeze and you're back at the beginning again. Got some sort of crazy arm thing going on. Uh, we're apparently going the right way, as the Starship Enterprise lets us know. I have played Distance, Fedrin, and I found it completely frustrating. <laughs> it was it, a lot of the reviews I've read about it too. Is it was really fun up until the point you have to start doing those wall jumps, like the side to side and up to oh god, up to down. You know, reversing your your direction. That 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 is. Uh, some people might like the difficulty, whatever, but it's I find it to be unnecessarily difficult. Uh, like, it should do a better job of snapping to one of the cardinal directions, or maybe an option to snap. Maybe they've added that. I, I played it way uh, months ago, before I moved, even. That's interesting. Alright, so where we gotta go? Oh, are these supposed to be, like, shipping containers? I think so. Alright. Oh yeah, and I guess that's the arm that picks them up. Got it! Got it! I understand the, uh... Abstract visual approximation here. I'm a very tiny human, if that's a shipping container, that's for sure. Perhaps I'm no human at all! I am a cockroach with a jetpack. <laughs> ah, rar boom. So... Oh. Well, that's a chasm if I've ever seen one. Okay, that's a save point, but I don't think I can make that jump. Mero lens flare. Do I have to go up on the arm? And then over to that? And then up? Maybe. Let's try that out. Let's get crafty! Thank you, Axel Rosie, for picking up the slack where I lack! in Twitch professionality. <laughs> See, I'm the type of streamer that's losing the money. <laughs> oh, what a jerk. All right, let's try... I don't think I can get up to that one, but maybe that one and then to that one. 
And then over there, then maybe up on those tubes. Tubes! Oh, maybe I can. Ooh. Oh, yes. Oh, gosh, just barely. All right, I'll take that. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, no, keep it in engaged. Engaged. Oh, God, I missed. Whoa, okay, okay. I'm gonna survive. All right, that was fun. All right, maybe we should try not to be so overzealous with our jumps. All right, oh, I missed that and that. All right, hold on, hold on. Doing it again. Plan this out, Kurt. All right, you made it up there. Ah, oh, sugar. Oh my god, this is, this is frustrating. Maybe, well, what am I doing? I could probably just make it over to here. With with ease. There's no, like, uh, other than the little crosshair in the middle there. I can't shoot or anything. There's no indication as to how much jet I have left in my jetpack. All right, let's just go to this one. <laughs> I just barely made it. And then up to here. All right, that'll be fine. Whoa, I started floating there. And then, whoa, don't look down, it said. The instructions said do not look down whilst jetpacking. And... Uh, oh, 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 get on this thing. Yeah, mad skills. Mm, mad skills. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it all the way. Oh, God, Kurt, God, Kurt, don't... <laughs> what did I just say about being too overzealous with your jumps? Oh, I was inside the tube. Huh. All right. Okay. So we're up on the roof now. Oh, and there's a blue a blue door. Do I enter the blue door? I think it's kind of, the the jetpack is directional. So if I'm looking up, it'll thrust me up faster. If I look down, it'll thrust me down and kind of reduce my jump. So that's why it tells you not to look down. Yeah, let's check out this door. Uh, hello? Anybody home? No, nope, just a random blue door. All right, that's fine. Ah, yes, the the piano phenom of Twitch. Is he live streaming? Is that really who I'm going up against? As if that was at all my competition. Can I? Oh, that's not the way to go. I gotta go around the long way. Can I go over the roof? Oh, God. Yes, apparently I can. I still don't see anything resembling a spire. That's a... That's a... What is that? that that's a... Smokestack. I'm assuming that's kind of an indicator where I need to be. Oh, that's... Oh, my God. I, I'm right way up here. That is the save point down there. All right, I'm going to try to... Okay, I guess fall damage, like I said, isn't really a thing, so I could have just taken that, but I slowed down at the end. All right, let's get another save point and get some sort of other... Cryptic poetry. I feel sad, but I feel happy because I'm coming back home. I'm coming back to home, excuse me. There's a bridge across the river that I have to cross alone, like a skipping rolling stone. <laughs> Dramatic pause. Seems like. Much like some of the other musical games I've played in the past, uh, the bends, if you will, seems like there's elements of the song. Oh, oh, that, oh, that's the same thing I just read. 
there's elements of this music that keep getting added with every save point, so... Perhaps we will reach a dramatic crescendo. Or crescendo, as they call them, in Condor. Alright, I'm assuming follow the red tube. The tube! Woo! Yeah, I got that part, thank you. Okay. I hope this isn't a maze. I didn't sign up for a maze. Thought this was a jumpy game. Uh oh. There's a break in your line there. Ba -ba 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 -doo. Oh no, is this a maze? Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm expecting some sort of jump scare or something. Um. See what's this way, I guess. Um, it's um. Do I go down? It seems like it continues there and goes flat. Oh, that's neat. You can kind of look over the. Oh no, you can't. <laughs> All right, I'm going down. Ho! Oh. I thought you were like. I thought I was like glancing over the ledge. No, no, you actually just thrust yourself upon the the whims of gravity there. Interesting. Oh, some unevenness there. <laughs> Obsessive compulsive. Ooh, this is a different geometry we're looking at here. Interesting. Non-linearity here. Oh, light! We have a new type of light in the distance. Oh, oh, yellow. Yellow's good. That's usually what the arrows are telling me to do. Unless this is like the entrance we just came from. That would be bad. Oh! Yes, indeed. That is a save point. I'm bl oh, God! That <laughs> tricksy game developer. Freaking me out, man. Okay. We're in a place. God, that is right in my eyes. Okay, I'm, I'm kind of like paranoid watching the ground to see if there's any tricksy uh, things, uh, holes in the ground. Who put the bomb on the sacred altar? Why should we die if it comes our way? Why should we care about a little button being pushed by someone we don't even know? <laughs> no, that was a little bit Christopher Walken-esque, was it not? Uh, there's some redness up there. And up there. Oh, maybe the maze like came out in multiple spots. Well, I'm gonna follow the blue and the yellow. But I'm gonna follow the blue and the yellow. <laughs> uh. Gosh. Ooh. What am I looking at here? Nice. Some interesting IKEA lighting. Very nice. Uh, 
Oh. Alright. Got up here. Oh god, I completely missed. Good job, Kurt. It's my, my first day with my rocket boots. Gotta get. Whoa! Gotta give me a break. I don't know what the heck that was all about, but I did it. Bonk my head. Alright, so let's try to go around this. Out, out. No, no, down. In. Okay. We are through the doorway. Oh no, not another maze. It's the blue maze. Oh crap, that is the blue maze. Okay, that's a dead end. Let's go this way. Oh yeah, the little beat in the background just got added with the last thing. That end. Oh, it's also the easiest maze ever. Alright. Very interested to see where this. Ooh, goes. I appear to be in a room. Uh, can I make it all the way up to that pipe? <laughs> Oh, apparently I can. Alright, land on the pipe. Where's the pipe? There's the pipe. I'm calling this a pipe. It's a square structure. Uh... There we go. And... out the top. Out the top. Alright, got out of the ducts here. Oh! We're in like a city. Very minimalistic city with all the advertising. Damn you, pop-up ads! Neat. Minimalist! I almost wish... You know, when, when you get textures like this that are on the ground in the walls, but then you have flat... Uh, geometries, I guess you could call them. Uh, you know, without textures, I almost feel like... They should have been designed one way or the other. Like, the entire world could be... These flat... You know, instead of using these... What are here to be stock textures, you know, use all these flat textures. There was a, there were a couple screenshots. Somebody removed all of the textures from GTA 5, and I'm like, I kind of want to play it like that. <laughs> it looks like Proteus. There's a, appears to be a Coke ad right there in neon signage. Is that by, by all means, is the, the lighting technology of the future? Neon. <laughs> So very easy to produce, and affordable, and economical, and environmentally friendly. Not so these LED bulbs. Alright, so far I'm not noticing any really overbearing difficulty. Like... You know, there's no, like, boss fights and stuff, or whatever. But what's that in the distance? None of the... None of the terrain or features are moving, like that little grippy arm. I suppose I would like... Well, I, again, I speak too soon, and this is one of the reasons why... I didn't want to just upload a 30-minute video and say, Nothing happened, and then actually have something happen later on in the game. It looks like Gravity Ghost is a lot like that. Like, if you just watch the first episode of Gravity Ghost, and you think that's all that there is to the game, no. Stick around, my friends. There are a lot more interesting mechanics that take place. Oh, okay, arrow. Going the right way, that's good. Whew, watch your step. Um, oh, I passed by it. Whoa, almost missed it. Yeah, there is indeed a gap. Mind the gap. Alright, coming down this way.
Oculus Rift. This should be made for Oculus Rift. That would be crazy. <laughs> That's another thing. I didn't see Oculus represented at PAX South. I kind of wanted to see about trying to, like... I really want to try Assetto Corsa with the Oculus Rift. I do feel like driving games, flying games, things where you're in a some sort of predefined cockpit is probably the best use of virtual reality. All right. Your your Hawkins, if you will. Mech Warrior games. Oh, this is like some sort of. Oh, cool. Good thing there was a ledge. Like some game, uh, game tables, booths had their own Oculus so that you can play their game with the Oculus, but there, was, I, I don't think there was a dedicated. Oculus Rift booth. Uh, I should probably. I just was. I, I just purchased a normal badge. I should probably try to apply for a media badge the next kind of gaming convention I try to go to. I could probably just ask Child's Play Charity if, if they can put, get me on the list. That way you can go to like the media hours. All right, I'm a little bit confused here. Have I seen a yellow arrow recently? I'm assuming I gotta get over there. But that uh, seems like a jump and a half. Yes, I've played Mech Warrior. Mech Warrior 2, Mech Warrior 3. Uh, the old uh, Windows 98 machine. <laughs> Those, those are some good times. I think I also bought it for PlayStation, even though I had it for Windows. Whoop, we found the edge of the city here. All right, I'm assuming I can make this jump. And there's a couple rungs of the ladder. I can fall to, oh God, I'm not gonna make it. Not gonna make it, not gonna make it, not gonna, okay, maybe gonna make it. Oh, okay. Um, can we go up a level? Yes. Yes, we can. All right. That was some skill. Mad hops! Going vertical. All right. Now the question is, can we make it up there? Oh, I hit my head. Oh, God. All right. Okay. Oh, I've hit my head again. And I've run out of... Oh, I'm not running out of juice. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Mad skills. Oh, wow. That's the city back there. All right. Try to get on this rooftop. Good lord. Does anybody see a spire? <laughs> Look, looking for a spire. So that I can hack it. Alright, arrows tell me go this way. Oh, don't look down. Yeah, it definitely, it propels you down if you look down while you jump. Yep. Alright, I feel like they're... a little bit of monotony with these long running sequences. That could be broken up better with jumping puzzles or whatever, but maybe that's not what they intended. Oh, I, I see a, a beacon! Got it! This game is called Condor, made for the Cyberpunk Game Jam by Connor Sherlock. Yes, thank you. A game that is not available in the Twitch library for me to denote. Whoa, okay. Oh, okay. I thought, thought there was a connection here. Oh, maybe I can make it. Just made it. Oh, OK. 
Okay. That's interesting. Watch it. Ooh. Oh, it's another Coke ad. This is the multinational conglomerate organization that we are trying to destroy. Fizzy drinks. <laughs> I almost fell off there. That would have been terrible. <laughs> What was that other game? Revolt? No. Receiver. Receiver was interesting. That was the game where you had to, like, press 17 buttons to, like, change your your, your gun magazine. And you had to, like, load the magazine with bullets. <laughs> it was fun times. Kind of had the, the cyberpunky kind of look to it. If you want to get lost in the jungle rhythm, Get down on the ground and pretend you're swimming. Are these lyrics to actual songs that I'm being subjected to here? Am I gonna get a content ID strike? Ooh, the music! Dramatic music! like doesn't seem to mesh. <laughs> Am I right? But it kind of does. Wait, how do I know I'm going the right way? Oh, that's the waste building. Okay. That's freaking out over there. What's the, uh... Oh, it's the draw distance. That kind of helps. Um... Uh, I feel like I should be going down the middle, should I not be? I've never said what the point of the game is, because I don't know what the point of the game is. I downloaded it, it says play or quit, I pressed play, and that's what we've been doing. How's the music? Is it, is it too loud? It feels a little bit loud in my headphones, but hopefully you can still hear my voice. Such magenta. The music is good, I hear. The music is good. All right, well, I'm just going down these corridors. Am I missing anything below? Yeah. <laughs> Blow out your monitors. You guys need any help finding any dead pixels on your monitors? Just full screen this. Uh, I don't look like I have any of mine. My monitor's getting old though. Alright. I seem to have lost my way here. I'm looking for those arrows. I mean, that, that looks important, does that not? That looks like some sort of ominous spaceship. Um, what, mm. Oh wait, there's a, there's a bridge. Oh, nope, can't get up there. All right, that's fine, that's fine. Find your way back. All right. There's a bridge there. Ooh, what is going on? Over there. Oh, and there's some pipes. All right, so this is definitely the way I gotta be going. But how do I get up there? Hmm. Is 
there a... Whoa! Nope, 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 nope. Oh, okay. That was interesting. Uh, let's try to get up here now. Come on, little jetpack. You can do it. Oh, just barely clawed on there with my toenails. <laughs> I I'm doing this barefoot. Oh yeah, this looks important. Yeah, every once in a while it seems like loops match. Okay, ooh. Gotta get out your... Get out your Moog! Your Moog, uh... Synthesizer. Moog! Kinda want one of those, but... <laughs> it would... <laughs> yeah, one more thing collecting dust in my office. Alright. I'm going to take you down, giant building of strange floaty things around itness. Hey, that's a but don't look down, don't look down, don't look down. That's interesting. Interesting. Okay, there seems to be a wire over there I could take if I need to. Ooh. Loop! <laughs> the loop begins again. Alright, so now... Okay. Yeah, that's not the way to go, that's for sure. Oh, wait, I see a pipe over there, but it doesn't seem to get me anywhere. Alright, so I guess we gotta take it this way. The long way around. Well, that's a thing I gotta do. I hear everybody. I hear everybody. Uh, I see everybody talking about twisted metal. I gotta find a way to record my PlayStation 2. Play some real console games. Oh, wow, they really are making me take the long way around here. Uh, wait, what? Can I make this jump? Oh, it's been really a long time since my last save. I don't want to find out. I don't think I can make that jump. Can I make it to this building? <laughs> I'm gonna find out! Okay. I've run out of juice. Keep going forward. Keep Must go forward. No, no, no. No! Why? Okay, wait. Whoa, we're back here. Oh, damn it, we're back here. If you want to get lost to the jungle rhythm, get down on the ground and jump off the cliff. Oh, God. Oh, it's a hamburger. <laughs> it's like a hamburger. <laughs> um, okay, maybe not so much anymore. All right. Uh, dang it. Yeah, like this whole walking long distances part I can do without. Oh, don't I need to... I need to get up here. Oh my god, how come sometimes I can get up, but other times I cannot? Let's try this again. Let's look up. Yeah, it is directional. When you look up, you jump higher. I think we gotta do it again, don't we? Huh! Ali whoop.
Beer, beer. Alright, so that is where I want to be so that I can take that wire up to the mothership or whatever that is. There might be another one on that building over there, but, uh... Yeah, let's try that as our goal. Blit Face plant. Alright. Tron? Yeah, I don't know if it was Tron... I don't know that Tron... The graphics remind me of Tron, but I don't know if the Tron music was this. Kind of like this. Reminds me a lot more of Blade Runner. Maybe, uh... Oh, what else? There's gonna be something else that reminds me of. A lot, a lot of 70s, early 80s movies use this sort of aesthetic. The, that noise. <laughs> All right, kind of going in the right direction. But I really got to get over there. Whoa, whoa. Um. I'm led to believe my abilities correctly. I can get up top here. Oh, that was beautiful. That was like right as I ran out. Alright, yellow building. I'm coming for you. Mm, I think maybe I want to Try to get to the top here, if I can. Yep, alright. Try to give myself the best possible... ...position. Alright, I want to get there. Alonzi! I keep looking forward and up. Oh, there's a save point, right there. On the yellow thing. Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Oh my god! No! <laughs> oh wait! Oh! Oh! Ah! Uh, I've survived somehow! Oh damn! That, I thought I... Oh god! Alright. So let's go back outside. And then back up. Oh god! Woo! Okay, yep. Alright! Woo! We made it! Alright, so I had the right idea. There's a save point on that yellow building. What's what's going on back there? Laser beams. Lasers. Frickin' lasers, man. Oh, of course. Things would get a little bit more difficult if you just haphazardly jumped to the middle there, you would have been scroogled. Textures freaking out, freaking out, man. Oh, am I gonna get up here? Uh, I guess we'll make it into a ledge. 
Alright, make it into the ledge. Alright. Oops, ran out. Alright, make it into a ledge. Thank you. Alright. Wow, this place is a lot bigger than I thought. Hey, another save thing. It's like a hand. Why do we die? It becomes our way. If you want to get high, build a strong foundation. Sink those pylons deep now. And reach for the sky. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I, I, are you smoking the drugs? <laughs> take him, take him the marijuana. What, what is all this poetry you're writing, son? <laughs> yes. Okay. Alright, having some problems traversing a slight gradient. I, I would really like to know what's going on here. Ooh. Shading. Dramatic shading. Whoa! We're in a place. Interesting. We are in the mines of Moria. Look out for the Balrog. I always wanted to build something like this in Minecraft. It's like a big underground chasm, like the mines of Moria. <laughs> but that would take too long. <laughs> you know what happens when I start long projects. The server gets reset. Dang it! Alright, so we've got a guitar solo going on in the background. Where do we gotta be? Um... Let's see what's on the outside here. Huh! Oh god, nothing. Nothing is on the outside. Alright, back, back in! Back in! Oh. Okay, wait, 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 I didn't realize there was a ledge here. Alright, that that actually helps. Maybe I can jump. Is that a place I can jump? I think that's a place I can jump. Let's try to go up. Another ledge, another ledge! Yes! Oh, wow, okay. A vertical gameplay going on here. Ow! Where am I? Who am I? Who shoots? Okay, alright. Didn't quite make that now, did I? Um. Ooh. I see blueness in the distance. Head towards the blueness. the blueness. Okay. <laughs> Very confused. Just want to see some progress. Oh, is there a doorway? Excellent. There's a doorway. Found a doorway. I also need a drink of water. Ah, liquids. Ooh, this is a new color. <laughs> just invented, just yesterday. Okay. Uh. Up the tube. Oh. 
Get onto the platform. Oh, I missed. Ow! Holy heck! Oh, is this... Have we found the core? It's a mighty crazy chandelier there, Ikea. Uh, okay, let's get up here. We must hack into the mother node. <laughs> okay, I'm freaking out. I can't see what's going on. Alright, there we go. Uh, there appears to be a platform up here. Maybe? Yep, there was, and I missed it. Good job. Oh, here we go, here we go. All right. Oh god, I missed it! Dang it! This whole pitch blackness is really interrupting my abilities to, to know what I'm doing. Here we go. Ow! All right. Ow. Up through the crevice. Up through the crevice. Oh, is that the spire? The, the Eye of Sauron. Okay. Okay. Things are, things are happening, everybody. So the thought takes... We started playing about an hour ago, so... I'll need a good hour to play the fidget game. I'm assuming this is this probably gonna be like, Congratulations! You've taken down the first tower. What? <laughs> oh, excuse me. It's one of those things you pick up at the science store. Spaceships in the distance. Bye, oh, missed. Okay, what just happened? I. All right, let's try that again. Ah, reach. All right, all right, hold, hold on to your butts, everybody. Oh God, don't fall off the edge. Things are about to happen. All right. Whoo! All right. Hold on. Hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about the consequences of my actions. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. It's a platform. It is not so much an Eye of Sauron as it is just a, a glitchy platform. Whoa! Speaking of glitchy platforms. Uh. Oh, we gotta go outside. Then in. I'm a top! Ooh. Said the condor to the praying mantis, we're gonna lose this place. Just like we lost Atlantis. Brother, we gotta go sooner than you know. The gypsy told my fortune. She said that nothing showed. Like an Inca. Oh my. Condor! <laughs> a game by Connor Sherlock. A game by Connor Sherlock. Uh, let us analyze that momentarily. Were those rockets? Did I start some sort of nuclear holocaust? Or were those spaceships? They were leaving the planet that I am on without me? Or something? Maybe? <laughs> Because he said the whole thing about leaving this place like Atlantis. I, I, I don't know, we're, you know, leaving for another planet or something. Um, I'm, I'm probably, I'm going to click for the parting music. And, and hope, unless you're recording for YouTube, it'll get flagged. I do appreciate that, good sir. So I'm going to not include this in the YouTube recording. But this was Condor, for those of you watching on YouTube. Link in the doobly-doo, and the link has been provided on and off throughout the stream here by Rosiebot. <laughs> Thank you very much. Let's, let's enjoy the parting music together. I'm not recording for YouTube. Alright. Alright, are you ready for some copyrighted music, everybody? Feels so dirty.